Here we go in the Atlantic we go. The next system that may form actually is already uh, has a history of being a name system and that is this disturbance number one. This was actually Paulette going back a couple of weeks now. So if it redevelops it would likely be renamed Paulette. There has a 60% chance of developing or I should say redeveloping into a tropical or subtropical system. Got the remnants of Wilfred out there. You've got Hurricane Teddy and Tropical Storm Beta now in the western Gulf of Mexico bringing heavy rainfall and the threat of surge along the Texas coast this morning. It will inch its way closer to the Texas coast, maybe make landfall. It'll be close and then track to the northeast through the second half of the week, bringing heavy rainfall not just to Texas, but up into Louisiana as well. Rainfall totals actually could be higher in Louisiana and in the New Orleans area where some forecast models are suggesting close to 15 inches of rain. Meanwhile, over in Texas, they could still see flooding rains of seven to nine inches of rain a little bit farther inland, but coastal flooding also possible with that threat for surge. And then we have what has been a weakening Hurricane Teddy right now, a Cat 2 hurricane with wind speeds at 100 miles per hour moving to the north at 9 miles per hour. It will graze Bermuda today. It will continue to track generally north before weakening over the Canadian Maritimes, but still they could be working with a tropical system later on this week.